Dr. Thomas Little was supposed to work here at the Perry Township Admin Center for another two years, but according to this EEOC complaint he filed, he says the district terminated him back in May because he has an autoimmune disorder. In the EEOC complaint, Little alleges when he returned from medical leave, his doctors had cleared him to return as superintendent, but the Perry Township School Board had other plans. Little says the board ended his employment in violation of the Americans with Disabilities Act and the Age Discrimination in Employment Act. Call 6 investigates reported Little will receive a $325,000 payout from the district, but Little's attorney says the former superintendent of the year is entitled to even more. He just wants the school board to live up to its promises. Little earns nearly $200,000 a year in base salary alone and had two years left on his contract. His attorney points out the district is wasting taxpayer money by paying Little and its current superintendent. If you're looking for outrage as to misuse and mismanagement of taxpayer dollars, it has to be the choices that are being made by the school board. Bet says a more cost efficient option would have been to allow Dr. Little to keep his job like he wanted. He wants to work and he's able to work. Dr. Little points out the board rated him as effective or highly effective in every single evaluation in his nine years with the district. He's now considering filing a lawsuit in federal court. Reporting from Perry Township, Kerr Kenny, RTV6.